IG-88 was a model of assassin droid that gained near sentience. There were four replicas made. Of those replicas, IG-88B was the second best bounty hunter in the galaxy. Despite an order to dismantle on site regarding the IG-88 series, Darth Vader hired IG-88B to capture Han Solo. Before leaving the Executor, the droid downloaded and transmitted information about the second Death Star to IG-88A. He then placed a tracking device onto the Slave One and followed Boba Fett to Bespin. There, Fett caught IG-88 in a trap, frying his circuitry with ion cannons. Fett then went in for the overkill, blowing the droid's deactivated metal casing apart with concussion grenades. He graciously offered Cloud City's Ugnaught population IG-88's remains. And here's a bonus behind-the-scenes fact. The same prop that was used for IG-88's head can be seen in Chalman's Cantina in A New Hope. That's it for today. Be sure to like and subscribe to see new Star Wars videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And if there's a specific Star Wars topic you'd like me to cover, please leave it in the comments and I might do an episode about it. Thanks for watching.